Right, so in this section, we're actually gonna talk about setting up of virtual machines. So why a virtual machine on DigitalOcean? Well, DigitalOcean is actually very, very cheap. Okay, it's very, very cheap. A virtual machine will come in at five US dollars per month at the time of recording, of course. They've also got loads of regions as well. Okay, so they've got, uh, they've got London, they've got America, they've got Germany, they've got India, they've got Singapore. So they're spread out all over the world. So there's a local region, or at least a relatively local region for anyone watching this course, which means that you can, you can use DigitalOcean pretty much no matter where you are. They're also very, very fast set up. So we'll go over setting up our account in DigitalOcean. We'll set up some droplets in DigitalOcean. We'll also add some SSH keys to our account and so on and so forth. And it's just perfect for our objective as well. You can just spin up the VMs. You've got an IP address, public IP address you can access, your SSH keys in place. We can add them to our Ansible inventory and we can start using the service, configuring them with Ansible straight away. What if you don't wanna use DigitalOcean? What if you don't actually wanna use something that's online? Well, there are two alternatives that I can recommend. And the first one is VirtualBox. Okay, go to virtualbox.org and you should be able to get that installed on Windows or Linux or Mac re relatively easily. Set up a couple of virtual machines. It's gonna be more complicated in VirtualBox than it would be in DigitalOcean. And then the other option is Parallels Desktop. So if you do a Google for Parallels Desktop, you'll see that's another alternative. It's a commercial alternative. It does actually cost money. If you're looking for just another alternative to DigitalOcean, an online one, there's AWS LightSail. So if you're more familiar with Amazon Web Services, you might want to look at LightSail. And then you've got Linode as well. So Linode is, is another option. Uh, it's just another LightSail. It's just another DigitalOcean.